This is Rebecca Jamerson. I'm Bill MacArthur. Hey. And we're going to fix this and make it all look new. And it's an old process that really isn't used anymore. Uh, but we like it, and so we're going to do it. And I think that's about all I can say. Okay. Uh, we're going to mix up some. Uh, this is uh, lime, pure lime, and molding plaster. Lime on its own won't do anything except fall off the wall. So we're going to mix the two together and What you're going to find is just repeat action for about 30 times until we build it all out to, oh, I guess this would be beneficial. Mm -hmm. This is the, uh, the tool we made that replicates exactly what's happening up there. And the rest is visual. Okay. <laughs> So what was it like, and, and what is the pink, did you have to trim this out to get it to the point where you're able to do something? Well, we, what we do is just build it out slowly and whatever, you can only do so much at a time. But with the molding plaster, it all gets hard within 15 minutes. Wow. So uh, you can basically, by the time we clean up one mess, we can start mixing another one. and. Stay busy. Okay. And I would suggest probably within an hour, a little bit more, I mean, probably be done. It's always better, we could have made this on a table and put it up, but it's more labor intensive that way. Here and there, as we're starting to take shape, this next one will be a little bit even better. What they build nowadays is not going to be there in two or three hundred years. How come you, for the edges, where it's still pink, you don't go near the edges for the well, preliminary? Good question. With this type of code, you would never be able to get it out. Oh, okay. So, those we fill in by hand and have special tools with a sharp edge on them to fill in it straight and you just cheatlessly follow what's there. Objectives. What are you trying to achieve here? You're getting a nice thick coat and it's holding to each yeah. successive one? It, it starts here and of course it's going to build out and then we have, we will build the top of this. As it swells, this can get shorter and then the blade wouldn't fit through. So we try to build these up for a good while and then take care of the inside. The main reasons I got into it was all these old beautiful churches that we used to do. 
And then we, when they got became qualified, they quit doing that. Nah. We get to repair them all. How many donuts do you think will be necessary for a project like this? Roughly, range. Uh, roughly 15 to 20. Wow, that's amazing. Uh, but then as it builds up, the donuts get smaller. You don't need as much. But you can see there's a lot of empty space in there. It's really hard to get it unless you put it on by hand. Mm -hmm. How do you decide to spray? When it starts taking shape, it's going to swell, like I said, uh -huh. and <clears throat> that'll help break off that 32nd of an inch. Uh, from now on, it's pretty much a constant thing. next to it. What's it look like? It's awesome. It looks so good. It is amazing. Great work, you guys.